Welcome to Aesthetic News, this is Jan Herdman and today I'm at the Get Well Medical Centre with Dr. Ashok Kapoor, a leading cardiologist and Dr. Sarita Kapoor, a leading gynaecologist here in Dubai. Welcome and thank you very much for joining us today. Thank you. Thank you so much. Can you just tell me a little bit about the Get Well Medical Centre, how it started, how long it's been operating? The Getwell Medical Star, uh, Center we started in 2003 mm -hmm. and in fact uh, we had uh, launched ourselves in Dubai in two, uh, 2000. So after three years of our practice when we thought that now we should be independent so that was the time we started. Mm -hmm. I was in Wellcare Hospital and Madam was practicing in another center at Al Alpha. We started, launched uh, Getwell in 2003. This is our 10th year of practice. Right. So what else do you, you, so you've got cardiology and you've got gynaecology, what else do you have at the centre? It's a multi-speciality medical centre. We practice uh, cardiology, obstetrics, gynaecology, Madam is doing that. We have pediatrics department, we have surgical department, we have orthopedics, we have dental department. So almost all specialities are available under the single roof. Together with the, we have one accredited JCI American lab by the name of Car uh, Cure Well Diagnostic Center. We will do all type of scannings and laboratory work. So almost all the OPD needs uh, we cater here and fortunately this year we launched our new departments in the form of aesthetic and cosmetology yes. and plastic surgery. And the latest addition is the physiotherapy which uh, very well supplements and supports our Sondre department, what we call as Get Well Sondre. Right. Can you tell me why you added the aesthetic side of things to it? See, it's probably, it was not only from the aesthetic point of view, it's more from the medical point of view mm -hmm. that we really needed this. Mm -hmm. Because uh, there were a number of patients who would even come up during pregnancy, after pregnancy, and in fact for infertility also. There are a number of medical conditions where the body mass index, where the, uh, the hair growth, the, cosme the pigmentation of the skin, mm -hmm. all these things were disturbing them a lot. Yes. And not only like see when it was a, when infertility patients were there, like polycystic ovary patients, overweight, pigmentation on the face, on the neck, mm -hmm. and the hair loss hair, from the hair, hair growth, facial hirsutism and all. So young, right from the young girls till the age from where they had to conceive and they had, we were always after them to have a BMI to come down, lose the BMI body, be as in yeah, body, body mass index, index. Yeah, to come down, to lose the fat so that the fertility rates would go higher. Right. Now that we've started seeing patients right from 17, 18 years of age who've been having polycystic ovary till, till the late age, even after having children, people are getting polycystic ovaries. So that was one of the reasons that you had to, they had, they were choose, searching for an answer where to get it out. And mm -hmm. that actually was the basic behind it. Plus then patients would deliver my doctor, my stretch marks, yeah. how did I go, I lost weight but my marks aren't going. <laughs> the old <laughs> vanity side of things. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Obviously nobody wants to look like a mother of two at the present. <laughs> want to remain the same figure and they maintain the figure but the, the other cosmetic part was not getting solved out. Mm -hmm. See for the pigmentation, the cloisma, what they get on the face during the pregnancy for quite a number of them would hang around after delivery obviously. Okay. So those pigmentation problems. So you've got a treatment of, for plus pigmentation? Acne, lots of acne in young girls, no PCOS patients, so many of them having acne on the face and all. So obviously off late also so many mothers brought their daughters over here so that they could get them. So because the girls have a lot of stigma that age, no growing age, yes. they will try to bleach their hair on the face, they are trying to do all the things. But they search for a permanent answer probably that was the aesthetic we wanted to add so that we could give a complete, complete uh, treatment to them. Lovely and, and Dr. Ashik, the, the um, cardiology or the cardiac patients how do they benefit from aesthetic treatments? Well, in fact, uh, I'm really uh, happy to tell you what actually they get after when they get the good health from the cardiology point of view. Yes. They are after their looks and beautification, they feel excellent heart-wise. Uh, so the heart's working, so now I want to look good. the risk yes. factors, we always keep on nagging them that you reduce your weight, you're obese and that was one of the main reasons, ah, stop smoking. So they are very much convinced that the risk factors 
had to be taken care of, but how to do it. So there came the role of our non-invasive or non-surgical liposuction with one of the tops, top of the range machines and equipment which we have made available in the aesthetic center. So they look more beautiful when they lose the inches on the tummy and the contours becomes better and all the same, their profile in fact whether with diet and exercise also gets better of the cholesterol, mm -hmm. their blood pressure gets better. So we are not only giving them a better aesthetic look, but medically and scientifically also we are helping them. Here's a question for you. Can the machines, as far as reducing inches, getting rid of fat, is that a, a substitute for exercise? Can, can someone who doesn't exercise, who wants to look better, lose weight, can they um, use the machine? We, uh, we, uh, in uh, one aspect, yes. I mean, so people who are really lazy cannot be pushed. Well, basically, the people who have got efforts. the high blood pressures and yeah, etc. It's totally a non exercise exercise program. Mm -hmm. While sleeping, they are being taken care of. Yeah. So, uh, that way, if you see the person who is really reluctant, reluctant. Plus, the number, there are a lot of patients who do all their exercise, do their efforts, still they are not able. So, we need to stimulate them, induce them. So here comes the role of non-surgical liposuction, okay. our lipo techniques and power shape, where they start losing inches over the day's time, very first day they see some results. So it acts at the neural mental uh -huh. level of them. Yes. And they get even more stimulated yes. or stimulated. When they see things happening, yes. they start and they, to they see the results. And then you don't want to maintain them, you don't want to give away <laughs> them. <laughs> That's yeah. their always. So, and for us also, you know, like you see us patients and all those who are overweight and all not conceiving, spending n number of, n number of dirhams for taking the injection injectables and medications. Now we also don't want them to give a really a figure figure. We want them really that if they, even they get down to five to ten percent of the BMI comes down, mm -hmm. probably their ovulation becomes better. The response to medications become better. Oh, is that so, right? Yeah, yeah. That is there. We are not asking a tremendous loss in the weight. But even the BMI comes down even to five to ten percent less. They, they their response becomes drastically very good. I had no idea. Intraceuticals treatment is basically infusing your skin with hyaluronic acid using hyperbaric oxygen. So we don't use needles. It's a very good way of hydrating your skin, bringing back the moisture. So uh, using hyaluronic acid without the needles. So um, what it basically does is it gives your skin, uh, it makes your skin more moisturized and um, younger looking. Hi, I've been having intracytical treatments in Gatwell Clinic and it's really good. I will really recommend it because it's been two treatments that I've got and I can see a big difference on my skin. I can feel that I really, I'm really fresh after the treatment and I can see my skin is really hydrated. Can you give me an idea of what sort of treatments you he have here? Is, are there a lot or are there, you know, two or three? Or? We like uh, for uh, losing weight around the tummy or contouring the various aspects of body. We have very two top of the range uh, equipments, what we call power shape and bionics. That's what we are using uh, for time being for our patient. And I think the results which we have seen in the last three, four, five months we will be doing it. Are really great amazing okay. amazing and they work on various different technologies and in fact in one of the power ship system there are three technologies combined together which uh, with the help of radio frequency and vacuum and ultrasonic wave system so there is a technique involved which is very scientific in fact the ultrasonic waves break the lipid cells which okay. are quite enlarged and distended in obese patients and when they break they release their triglyceride Mm -hmm. And triglyceride have a normal route to go through the lymphatics and utilize elsewhere and pass through the body, yes. for which we have a vacuum suction technique in the same machine. So there are the transducers available, very good uh, non-invasive procedure. 
Okay. The patient is very comfortable. He keeps on watching the TV. The procedure is being done. So he feels very good. <laughs> Pain free, <laughs> watch television, lose weight. Hmm. Yeah. Gee. So this is, this is one of the. Uh, He's here. Yeah. <laughs> Pick me, I'm in. <laughs> right. So he, he goes smilingly out, and at the end of the procedure, they again measure, do the measurements. And in front of them, they see the reduction being happening. So they're excited, they're stimulated, and some of them start asking to do it every day. Really? So we have our protocols, we don't disturb them. Mm -hmm. But then, uh, end of the day, the results are there. This is what we look for. So, um, just finishing up on that, do you have um, a laboratory or anything like that that you can measure the levels that of um, uh, percentage increase in, in lipids, etc.? Yes, in fact, we have a full-fledged uh, JCI accredited laboratory, as I said, Cure Well Diagnostic Center. So we will do all full range of blood tests. So from our aesthetic point of view and medical point of view, we always look forward to see a lot of patients who have high lipids to come down. Mm -hmm. So when we combine all this, what we are doing, we do lab tests for the cholesterol, sugar and triglycerides before starting and even after the procedure is completed or the six weeks of program. And we are seeing in many cases, of course it's a combined effort, not of only of this, but medicines, exercise, mm -hmm. diet. But we see drastic, very good, fantastic results. Mm -hmm. The cholesterol becoming better, the HDL improving, mm -hmm. and the sugar levels getting better. So that uh, helps medically. Fantastic. So this is how we do in Pure yes. World Diagnostic Center, take them there, do their blood tests, and see the profile. Fantastic. Right, well I'm going to shift now to the um, surgical side of things, plastic surgery, you mentioned that. Um, can you tell me what sort of procedures that you, you do um, and how they are also assisted by the aesthetic side of things here? The plastic surgeon, he's, uh, he's attached to Gatwell Medical Center and uh, we have a minor OT coming up over here and uh, that what he's going to go ahead and uh, we are planning to do all the types of uh, weight reduction surgeries and the facial uplift what the patient want the hair removal and the hair transplants which mostly the so basically you you have everything to offer uh, the, the patient who was wanting to um, get well and look a lot better and feel a lot better from uh, physios to uh, machines. Um, how do you see this expanding further? In fact, uh, we have a lined up patients for all these procedures and Dr. Manoj's plastic programs. And that's why we really feel we need to grow further. We have plans already to put more centers in Dubai. We are looking for, uh, in fact, we are getting offers from various other Middle East countries also. Back home in India as well, we are putting... To set up centers over there? Yes. yes, yes. Because our program is to give a you know, full package. In fact, uh, we start from the basics A and we go to JET. Well, it sounds great and I think you'll probably have, as I said, uh, a list of uh, clients walking out the door. So. Thank you very much for joining Let's me. Get well, heal well, feel well, look well. <laughs> <laughs> Say that once more. Get well, heal well, feel well, look well. <laughs> oh, great. And cure well is our diagnostic. <laughs> Lovely. So Thank you both very much for Thank, joining me. Thank, Thank you so you. much. Thanks. Thanks. Thanks very much for joining us. This is Jan Herdman on Aesthetic News and I'll see you next time.